Let's go. We got a video. This video is about Archek Robot. One single person can pilot it. It's like getting your own personal transformer. We're going to check it out, see what they're working on, see how the development is coming along, and then go from there. All right, let's check it out. I know I would want to get one or at least rent one out or go to some type of theme park and ride in it. That thing looks cool. It looks insane. I would love to try one out. I would love it. Main switch on. Mode change. Vehicle mode. I'm definitely trying to fight with the Transformers. If I got one of those, I'm trying to fight with the Transformers. In real life, I'll make it a reality. It's so cool. Yeah, that thing is so cool. I mean, we got another video just like it, but this thing is like so cool. Like, I can't believe it. I definitely want one, or at least I don't think they're gonna be for, really for sale. Nobody gonna really buy it because it's so big. But imagine just at least renting one out or going to a theme park and riding in one, and they let you smash things around you and go ham and do all that. It looks so cool. Now it does have legs, four legs. It has four arms as well. A Japanese um, company developed it. So, but it does have four legs. I think they can walk. I'm trying to find some videos to check it out. But um, right now I think it's gonna be on, um, you can actually just drive it. Um, and then you, they have so many little TV screens in there. You can see exactly where you're going. So it's pretty cool. See those big arms? Look at them big arms, that big hand. That look crazy. They did a good job in developing it. Looks cool.
I wonder if the military um, started using it, would it be better to use these, like a mech suit, than, um, than like, you know, how they be having the super soldiers. Um, like they can be able to drop 10 or 15 of these suits, robotic suits, wherever the, you know, the war is and fight it that way, or is this will be better to, you know, do a little bit smaller with, you know, the humans can actually just have a little bit of equipment available on them to become faster. I wonder what one would be better, or you can kind of use both at the same time. Was it in a movie like this, sort of, where one pilot can pilot some type of uh, machine like this, a robotic machine like this, and he was fighting wars? If y'all remember that movie, let me know in the comments. But this is, um, yeah, these developers showing off these past couple years. They've been showing off. They've been making so many things because this is impressive. Yeah, so I remember, I think it was the Hulk. Wasn't the Hulk when he couldn't, when the Hulk didn't come out? Um, Banner uh, got into a suit. I forgot what movie that was. I forgot what movie that was. But I remember Banner got in it because the Hulk didn't want to um, fight. I think, um, I mean, people can't buy it. It's just too big, too large. Um, but I do believe that maybe just the military, the military will be, um, you know, will want to put in the bid to buy it. It's another part of the military. Send a couple in, take down the enemies, go from there. Or you can just rent it out from a theme park and then go from there. All right, guys. Until next time.